Schedule preview time. I, I love doing this. What am I looking for? Oh, yeah, right here. I love doing this. Um, everybody always wants to jump to predictions. What's your prediction for this team next year? This starts like literally the minute the national title game ends, right? What's your record prediction for this team for next year? Prediction for that? Look, there's a lot of... There's a lot of things that have to happen. There's a lot of steps you have to go through. There's a lot of time that has to go by between a national championship game ending and being able to make record uh, predictions for a team for the following year. Signing classes, transfers in and out, coaching hires, coaching losses, spring practice, injuries, all those kinds of things. Now, it doesn't matter how long you wait. There's obviously a lot of guesswork that goes into uh, predicting a team's record, especially when you do it the way I do it, which is not just predicting a team's overall record, but, you know, if I think a team's going to go 10-2, and two, I tell you the two teams I think they're going to lose to. So I predict a win, you know, winner and loser for every game on each team's schedule. But one of the big milestones to me, every quote-unquote offseason, uh, where I know I'm getting closer to being able to do record predictions is schedule previews. And I'm going to do a whole series of schedule previews over the next several weeks. We're going to cover a bunch of teams in all five of the Power Five conferences and even a few non-Power Five teams. Some of the Power Five teams that I think have a chance to make some noise this year or find themselves in the top 25 at some point during the season, things like that. And of course, I'll be taking suggestions from you, the viewer, on which teams you want to see me do a schedule prediction on. Now, these are not uh, a schedule preview. Schedule preview. These are not predictions. This is basically looking over a team's schedule uh, and, and doing a couple of different things, comparing it to the previous season's schedule. Is this year's schedule harder or is it easier? Do they play a more difficult non-con schedule in 23 than they did in 22? Uh, what about their conference schedule? Are there more difficult games? Um, or, 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 or do they have more difficult road games this year than home games or home games? Obviously, those things will matter. And when I get ready to do predictions later on, Things that I talk about in these videos will be one of the things that goes into uh, making those predictions. Where's the bye week? Uh, are there any difficult two or three stretches of games in a team's schedule? That can make a difference, right? Back-to-back -back road games can make a difference. You get the idea. I just kind of like to glance over teams' schedules. So we'll do a whole series of those. But look at this. Look at this. Now, I wore this on a live stream um, a couple of weeks ago. And some of you good people asked about it. But check out this jersey. Now, this is a nice jersey. Look, 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 look. Blue tube jersey. No, I'm not asking you to run out and buy a blue tube jersey. Don't. Work. But look, all of this stuff, this is ironed on. Uh, I mean, uh, these are uh, sewn on. Not ironed on. Not uh, screen printed. None of that. All of it. The numbers, the name, the logo, the numbers on the sleeves. The name on the back, I don't know if you can see that, but I mean, the name on the back, everything is sewn on. These are high quality jerseys. I've had this one for about a month. I wanted to wear it for a while, wash it a few times, wear it, see how it held up. It hasn't shrunk. Um, it hasn't faded. It still looks exactly like it did uh, uh, like it did the day I got it. Check them out. The link is in the description down below, not blue tube jerseys. These are cust fully customizable jerseys, high quality. Everything is sewn on. You can customize everything, the colors, the color pattern, whether you want the striped collar or not, how many colors on the striped collar. If you do, do you want a logo on your shoulder? Do you want your team name on the front? Do you want numbers on the sleeves or not? What number do you want? You can literally design every single detail and aspect of these jerseys in their high quality. I wouldn't steer you wrong. There's a link down below. Click the link, check it out. High quality jerseys, under $60 a piece. Uncle Lou said so. Okay, now back to these schedule previews. So um, they're going to be really in no particular order. I'm just going to kind of cherry pick different teams whose schedules I'm interested in, schedules I want to look at for next season. And like I said, be sure and let me know down in, in the comment section of this video. And once the schedule uh, video, once the schedule preview videos start getting posted, let me know in the comment section of those videos which teams it is you want me to do. I can't promise you that I will do every single team uh, that is commented, but if I see the same team commented a bunch of times by a bunch of different people, then obviously I'm likely to do that team. Or hit the thumbs up next to someone else's comment. If someone comments uh, Tennessee and you also want to hit uh, see Tennessee, hit the thumbs up on you know I, I see a team with a bunch of 
thumbs up in the comments, uh, I'll be more likely um, to do it. But uh, I really do like this part of the offseason when I sit down and go through the uh, schedules. Because look, if you don't know who a team is playing or where they're playing them at, is it home, is it away, is it neutral, how can you possibly have any idea what that team's record might be? Now, you might say, well, uh, uh, such and such teams going undefeated are the best team in football. It don't matter where they play. Okay, that's that's a, that's one, two, three teams a year maybe that have a realistic shot of going undefeated. What about the other 127 teams? I mean, a lot of times the difference in ten and two and eight and four, or nine and three and seven and five. A lot of times the difference in those two records is who do you play in the non-con, and are your tough games on the road or are they at Home, Tennessee is a great example of this last year. Tennessee was undefeated at home last year. Had one of the best home environments in all of college football last year. A huge help to them in their win over Alabama at home, right? Um, lost on the road to Georgia. Lost on the road to South Carolina. Clearly where you play a game makes a difference, especially in the SEC. But um, that's true really of any uh, big-time college football program with a significant home field advantage. So you have to take some time to go through these team schedules ahead of time before you start trying to figure out, okay, uh, is this team winning the division, winning the conference, making the playoffs? Are they going 12-0? and Are they going 10-2? and You got to know who a team's playing, where they're playing them at. Are there any really difficult – like, in other words, some team might be able to beat um, South Carolina. Some team might be able to beat Tennessee. Some team might be able to beat – Florida, all in the same season. Would they be able to beat those three teams in a row, though, right? These are the things I look at when I do the schedule previews. They've been pretty popular um, in the past, so I'm going to do it again. And like I said, it's selfish reasons why I do these schedule previews. Believe it or not, you know, I do actually put some time, thought, and consideration into my predictions that I do uh, later in the offseason. And part of what helps me develop my predictions uh, is this series of schedule preview videos that I do. So anyway, I hope you enjoy them. Check out the link down below. Amazing jersey. Hell, get you a LooTube jersey if you want. Probably be the smartest thing you ever did. But in any case, click the link. Uh, the thousands and thousands of jersey designs to choose from. Fully customizable. Everything is sewn on high quality. Check them out and have a good morning.